Welcome everyone to another episode of Trippin' with Brian. Please like and subscribe. The lovely wife and I took an amazing French river cruise on the Armachella. From Arles, up the Rhone, to chalon sur -Sain. Wait. We didn't make it to chalon sur -Sain because, remember that strike in France? Of course you do. The French are always striking. Somehow, some of the river locks had broken and wouldn't function. But Ama Waterways did an outstanding job of literally going out of their way to ensure our riverboat crews didn't stop. Like the river locks. In fact, they physically moved us from the Amicello below the broken lock to the Ama Cristina above the broken lock. All the while, we were on buses, stopping to taste wine and see new villages in the French countryside. This is a video about our first experience on a French river cruise on the Ama Cristina. There will be many more episodes about this excursion. So sit back, hope you enjoy it. As I mentioned before, while Emma Waterways transported our luggage from one ship to another, they were busing us to places they didn't usually travel. One of those places was the Chateauneuf du Pop village in the Vaucluse department in the Provence Alpes Côte de Azur region in southern France. It truly is a beautiful region of ancient history, a hilltop majestic preserved castle, and of course, wine. From the tiny wine shop of the KBL establishment to the enormous Bouchon winery, we enjoyed a fantastic time exploring the village. I'll go into greater detail about the Chateauneuf du Pop adventure very soon in another video. When we were headed back to our bus, we happened upon the L'Etant du Chateauneuf du Pop wine fair at Salle du Fay. We didn't have time to stop and explore, but it did look so fun. Steak and potatoes are definitely on my diet. Later that day, after our unplanned excursions, we arrived at the Ama Cristina, named after Emma Waterway's co-founder, Kristen Karst. It was a bit of an upgrade from the Amicello. We were given an equivalent room of about 170 square feet, but our French balcony was much nicer. On the Amicello, only one pane of the sliding glass doors opened. But on the Ama Cristina, both doors slid to the side to give twice as much of an opening to the outside. It was really nice to sit there in the evening with a pre-dinner drink and enjoying the fresh air, life on the water, watching the people on shore going about their own way. The Ama Cristina was built in 2016, so it's eight years newer than the Amicello, with nicer furnishings, tile, decor, even though our river trip had been cut short in distance due to the strike, we felt lucky to be aboard the nicer Ama Cristina. The river ports are so small, the ships have to stack or raft next to each other. This riverboat is the MS Annabelle, operated by Phoenix Risen. She arrived before us, so we rafted next to her. As we would come and go, we would walk through the Annabelle to get to our ship the Ama Cristina. You can see just how close they are. At one point, the Annabelle planned to depart the next morning. So we switched sides. The ships maneuvered and we were then moored to the port and the MS Annabelle rafted to us. The Ama Cristina's main lounge and bar area are very beautiful and open. It's here that guests arrive for an early afternoon aperitif with new friends, happy hour, information sessions, live music, and even dancing. Just outside of the observation lounge is the Al Fresco Terrace. In March, it's pretty cool out there, but it does offer fresh air and a really nice view. It's amazing to watch the French people enjoying life, running, visiting with each other, walking to work, and surrounded by such beautiful architecture and history. A short staircase from the Alfresco Terrace leads to the lower sun deck with relaxing lounges and a wonderful view of the city that you've stopped to visit. A short walk and you arrive at the sun deck, beginning with the heated pool. In the heated pool you can relax with a drink and take in the fabulous view of the city. 
sunrises and sunset of once in a lifetime. The sun deck seems to go on forever with dozens of personal lounges and umbrellas, games like cornhole, putting, and giant chess. And there is the sun deck of the MS Annabelle. If you're a smoker, especially a cigar smoker, you can enjoy your smoke on shore or at the aft of the sun deck. The Ama Cristina is such a beautiful river ship. And don't forget the endless five-star presentations of gourmet food. The wine and the drinks just keep coming. And first-class service from the crew. I hope you enjoyed the video and hopefully it'll help you in planning your next European riverboat cruise. Look for many more French River Cruise videos coming up soon. If you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. Hit the bell and you'll be notified when we post another video. Thanks for joining us again on Trippin' with Brian.